So I'm going to do a really fast video. I'm hoping I'm on camera. They said they can go above um, in the apartment up upstairs and shift the lens so that I'm out of the camera. But you know what? They're going to do what they're going to do. I'm just going to keep exposing them. So I want to show you a really cute craft and it's a quick and easy craft. So I'm going to hold this and try to get this craft for you. So this is a jar. You know how I always tell you guys about taking a jar and putting it on these candle holders. So this is a candle holder from the dollar store. They're trying to change the lighting. Again, I'm being harassed and stalked. I'm keeping, I'm going to keep exposing this. This started when I started working at Lacoste, L-A-C-O-S-T-E in 2016. And it escalated from then on. So I'm going to keep exposing what they're doing to me. I think it was because I was a good worker and then I left and moved on with my life and they couldn't handle that. But again, let me just show you. This is the candle holder I got from the, my mom got it for me from the dollar store. It was a dollar 25. You can get it online if you can't find it at the dollar store. So this is the candle holder. I glued an, a pickle jar, a used pickle jar. What I do is I rinse it out with Lysol or pine salt, any type of salt, because that smell is a, a nice smell, but it also take makes it really clean. And um, then I took off the label. This is the bot. This is the bottom of the jar. This is the top of the jar. This is the lid. So you guys can see that's the lid. This is the top. And I put a little card note in this jar with some uh, pine cones. These are these are artificial. These are or maybe they're real, but they're the uh, ornaments. So they're not from like the outside. I don't know how it would work if you just get one from outside, but they're ornaments. And then I put, I had um, these little pine cold cone decorative things with berries. So you see the little cardinal sneaking in there in a little branch. So cute. And again, this was a free crap because I had everything and I just reused it but I had. This was a jar and I put one of these tea lights that came from the doll. So it was a two pack in the jar to make a little, um, a little bulb. So this is kind of like a little bulb and you can see how that little bulb can be moved to different places. I'm going to work on this project soon. I took a, a light string put it into this plastic container. It kind of looks glass, but to cut glass is so difficult. And I took this, this is a um, water jug that I slit in half. So if I want, I can detach this and open it up and put more tea lights in there. And I'm going to work on making a shade. So I wanted to show you that. Then this is just another jar that I put some glass gems on and you can see I have a tea light in here and these tea lights turn off and on when you move them. So that's off. And then when you move it, it goes back on. Let me try to get that. There we go. There. So it goes back on. This is a jar that I put some salt inside. You know, the salt that you get from the, the pretzels. I put some salt inside some glass gems. So it kind of has that look of a, a snow globe or something to that effect. So I'm showing you guys how you can make these things for so inexpensive. This is a jar I got from the dollar store. I'm going to try to do something similar to this with a regular jar. And I just put some pine cones in here. This was a hand towel roll that I simply ripped, well, cut, and then glued together like this. I saw something like that from a YouTube video. I loved it. And I created that. This is a frame with a card. So if you have a really beautiful card and you see how we have the bird here and that goes back to the holidays. So, you know, for Christmas, whatever holiday you celebrate, the, the theme of having birds. I'm going to tell you, I have a video where I created this uh, black Christmas tree. And I love this because this is a... Um, this is a tissue box that became the base of it. And you see how it carries the colors of that black and gold. And I put a little bit of gold pen at the bottom so that it gives that little bit of shine. 
So I hope you guys like this video. Please subscribe for more. I'll do gang stalking videos soon, but I will do that at a different time. Thank you for watching.